What's up guys, welcome back to our channel, it's Z and Abs, the Zabs Project, bringing you back another episode of the lovely Audi A3. Today we're going to be working this rear quarter. Sanded this rear quarter to bare metal, reason being because we got a nice piece of kit here, a dent remover. So Abs, uh, do you want to unpack it? Yes. First time we've actually been using this, normally we see on YouTube, you know, a couple of YouTubers use this stuff kind of stuff. I'm excited at the same time, but I'm scared as well. A little gun. Is that here? Let's see, we've got these various stuff here. I think this just hooks into those pins there, pins yeah. Pins there, and then uh, we should put the machine in it, twist, and it keeps pulling out from there. Yeah, straighten the rear out. Mm. I'll put them on the floor as I unbox them like that. The worst one I'm going to open up, shall I open it? The bar? Yeah, you need to open that up. That's the main thing. this and we've got the gun so if you put that uh the, that metal bar onto the gun first so let's give it a little uh, trial on it? well i haven't got a clue any instructions <laughs> no the other way around the other way around no yeah. you can't there's not enough to twist it with yeah which is hooked, hooked onto, onto the back of the there, yeah perfect and then, do that. and then this bit here should hook onto the gun that hooks onto these pins that goes onto the rear quarter Alright, so these are welding bars. Yep, and then you've got a hook. So that's what we're we'll into the, yeah, the single No welding bars, these are the bars to make it straight through that. Through and the pins. These little uh, zigzag ones, and then you've got some switches. Oh, so these, this is probably what needs to go on the gun, I think. You open this, open that up. And then you've got a pack of these keys. Alright, so open that small packet. We haven't got a clue what we're doing with no instructions. Right, so you got a switch. That's his extra switch. Switches, and you got a bullet. Oh, sorry, this to tap it in, I think. Okay. And you got this. What's that? Is that the, the th yeah? That's the thing that goes into the thingy, into the gun. And you got another one. Well. There's two of them, yeah. And then you got. And then you got a key in it. All right, let's do a bit of research and we'll be back. Right, so a bit of a research. And we're back, so go on abs. So you got the gun. This part of the puller goes into the gun, so you see that. It's like a drill basically, so you loosen this and this hole gets bigger and then you just push this in. And then tighten it up. And then just tighten it up like a drill, so. And what that does is holds it in position now. Ooh, nice. So now, what's next? Now we've got the other part that goes in the part over there. Okay, after trying that machine spot well dent remover, we realized there's another machine behind that gun that actually does all the work, which we haven't got and we couldn't find. So, we've gone and bought another thing. It's what we should have done earlier. And show you guys. Unboxing. Unboxing. A new product. Well, new to us, but oh, old yeah. in the market. Yeah, but it'll be new to us, so we'll say new. Okay, so it comes with this European uh, style so, yeah, plug. European we don't need, kit. we don't need. This is only a dab dog. That's the first thing. Ooh, nice! That's like a briefcase! Da -da. We are. So this is a uh, mini spot welding gun that removes dents. See the other one had um, a bigger type, but this has got like a uh, pin type spot welders. Uh, so you've got your Remove a hammer. That you got. Don't know what that is. Don't know what that's for. Oh. Extra little add-ons. Yes, these are the ones we use in the other gun. That's what I prefer to use. But let's see how it goes. And this is your gun. So it's best to read instructions because when you hold the trigger, you gotta see how long you gotta hold the trigger. Like it's very sensitive trigger. So yeah, you but they trigger it off and done. Yeah, apparently they're saying you have to hold it for a certain amount of time or something. All right, so yeah, as per Abdul, read the instructions, which you never do. Nope. And this way you do the instruction. You don't need the instructions. Yeah, just 
we're the, we just want to crack on with it and then when it ruins it then we say oh my god let's go to the damn where's instructions, the instructions? Where's the instructions? Yeah, yeah. let's just keep it one side don't throw them like that <laughs> well, no, no, let's read it let's, let's, go, be, read let's it. be sensible yeah so this part you need to read in it so they're giving the pictures to kind of give you an idea as well yeah, yeah. see that see that there that part there or that part there is what we need in that quarter panel over there the top part so it just kind of brings it all together up so this should go in here, like that. There's no preheat to it or anything, just no, literally. No, 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 plug it in, press it, done. Put it this slides up. in like this, like that. Oh yeah, and then it clicks in, doesn't it? Yeah. All right guys, as you can see, we've got all them uh, welded on there and there, but obviously we've got to clean all this rust surface up. Uh, so this was like a test fit to see if it actually um, sticks on, yeah it does, and, and obviously put the tool in and you can, if you're sorry, you can hammer it out. So that's all working. So we're going to try to pull this area of dent out um, and then obviously see what we can do from there, how much it comes up. It's just a, a, a game of patience. You've got to keep doing it and just keep switching over. So basically you can't keep doing it just to, for example, the far end, you can't keep doing it. That. Do that, they jump on the next one, next one, next one, they go back again like that. So that's how it works out. All right, the rear car is all knocked out. As you can see, it's nice and straight. We also got this uh, filler on there, just need to sand it down. Also, the front end nice and complete. The front headlight, bumper, bonnet, all nice and spread on the car. Also, as you can see on the other side, that's nice and complete as well. Wrap up for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Stay safe, stay blessed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.